everyone, it's me, Katie Beth again. And today I just wanted to make a quick video uh, just sharing with everyone what I learned on my quick little road trip I took out of state. It's the first road trip, it's the first road trip I've really taken since the major part of the pandemic. We kind of stopped traveling a lot because of it. But on this 4th of July, I thought I'd take a tiny little road trip and it was kind of like culture shock. First off, like, no one's wearing masks anymore. Uh, I live in Orange County and people, probably like 20, 25% of people wear masks still, unless you're at a gym and then 1% wears it. That's me, I'm the 1% that wears a mask at the gym. But anyways, traveling and normally in stores and whatnot, there's still at least 25% of people, maybe 40% still wearing masks. But as soon as I left the state, I went to Arizona. I was planning to do Arizona, New Mexico, go see the little green man in Roswell. Didn't make it that far. I'll save that story for another time. But as soon as I left California, like no one was wearing masks. They saw maybe two people in Arizona wearing masks. Secondly, is Arizona not patriotic at all? I was traveling on the 4th of July and down here in Orange County, I guess, cause we're always at the beach, but everyone just kind of dressed in uh, American flag stuff. And there were hardly any decorations out. Uh, I stayed in Phoenix, which is a big city. So you'd think there'd be more stuff. There were a little bit of fireworks, but nothing like Orange County. Orange County, if you stand up on a hill and look down, it's just a pile of smoke and flashes. So that's what I came from. And then I went out to really just like a poo, poo little fireworks once in a while. But I digress. Back to the things that were different after traveling after all this time. I noticed that hotel prices seemed to have gone down a little, which was nice. And they even had like some better hotel deals. The deal I got was free parking, which hardly ever happens anymore. It was supposed to give me a $25 Amex card when I checked out, but they just gave me a credit on my bill instead. And that was through the Hilton Club. But anyways, prices seem to be going down for hotels. Gas prices seem to be going back up again. And traffic is back to normal. Oh my, traffic is back to normal. Sadly, another thing that's back to normal seems to be that hotels, at least the one that I stayed in, and it's through the ho uh, Hilton, so it should be a nicer place but cleaning has gone down. They did still have the sticker on the door telling me that it's been cleaned, but, and I know all hotels have this issue with like, they just clean in a hurry, but the shower was gross. Like it looked like dirty feet had all been in the shower and it hadn't been wiped off at all. So I had to clean the shower myself to even take a shower. Also the gym wasn't well stocked. And I felt like when I did travel during the pandemic, things were really well stocked. Like towels were there, the extra headphones were there, cleaning supplies everywhere. I had to search to find the cleaning supplies in this gym, but they were still there at least. Also something I was not ready for was buffet styles are back. The hotel I stayed at it had a free included breakfast, but most of the area was back to buffet style things that I just was not ready to have strange people breathing on my food. Was not ready for that. I still am not ready for that. Why are buffet styles back already? We're not completely out of it. Other than that, my trip was so short. Uh, not much really happened for me to make a cool video on. I just was culture shocked by, I guess how m normal things are now, how things are so much more back to normal than I thought they would be, especially when I leave my little Orange County bubble. I just, myself being such a hermit, was not ready for the world to just be maskless and cleaningless and buffet-styled food. Well, that's my report of a uh, tra travel after the pandemic. It's still not over, but like after the main hump, just how things have, I got so used to how things were this last year. And now it's just back to normal. Uh, I guess I have the rest of my life to get used to that. I just wasn't expecting it to be so soon. Well, thanks for watching my report, everyone. Uh, I hope this was helpful. If any of you were like me that just didn't know what to expect once you leave your house and go back into the world. 
Things are crazy. Back to normal. I'm still blowing my mind. Blowing my mind. <sighs> Again, thanks for being here with me. Thanks for watching. And have a great rest of your day, everyone. Bye.